Recently, iPhone users have become afraid that the front-facing camera might be taking photos of them every 5 seconds as seen in these types of videos. But is iPhone actually taking your photo, and if so, why? Well, it's true that the infrared camera activates about every 5 seconds and shoots out 30,000 invisible dots. This isn't the phone taking a photo per se, but it is checking to see what's in front of it. It's part of iPhone's True Depth camera system that debuted on iPhone X, and Apple's been using it for a variety of features to make iPhone more functional. Initially, it was used to map your face and use it as a biometric authenticator, so that when you unlocked your iPhone or bought an app, you didn't have to enter a passcode or password. Instead, the infrared camera would shoot out those 30,000 dots to map your face and confirm your identity. But why then would Apple continue activating these dots even after you've unlocked your phone? Well, it has to do with something called attention-aware features. You can find it in settings under Face ID and Passcode. These capabilities utilize the infrared face map while the device is being used in order to do a variety of things. For example, if you haven't touched your iPhone's display in a few minutes, it'll check to see if you're looking at the display before dimming it to save battery. Before, iPhone had no way of knowing where you were looking, and it would dim the display regardless. It also allows iPhone to lower the volume of alerts and alarms once it recognizes that you're looking at the device. Before, turning down these sounds meant scrambling for the stop or snooze buttons. And when you wake your device, notifications will automatically expand to reveal message previews or calendar event details that would otherwise remain hidden if your face wasn't recognized. Plus, all the mapping data of your face is stored locally on iPhone's secure enclave, so no one, not even Apple, has access to it. But if you'd still prefer to turn this feature off, you can simply flip the toggle in settings. This is Greg with Apple Explained, thanks for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next video.